Those evacuees have been staying at the RV park at Cal Expo for the past two weeks, anxiously waiting and watching the news as the Caldor fire continues to move. We took a picture from our deck at night and you can see the bright orange sky off in the background and having never been through anything like that before, it was obviously immediately just very scary. Hours later, Teresa Tobin, her three teens, husband and dog packed up and left their Somerset home with the Caldor fire burning just miles away. Um, as of right now, our home is still standing. Um, Good news for them, but they continue to anxiously wait until the area is safe from fire and they can return home. Since then, they've joined several other families who took to the Cal Expo RV park to find refuge from the devastating Caldor fire. Our daughter lives here in East Sac and uh, uh, we stayed with them for a few days. Uh, they had this beautiful trailer that we could stay in. U.S. Navy veteran Roy Turner evacuated from Camino with his wife and dog. They're feeling cautiously optimistic that the fire burned past their home and learned it's still standing. Meanwhile, they're planning to stay until... Uh, we're not going back until we're allowed back. It's, uh, uh, we're going to follow the instructions that were given by the authorities. All the evacuees I spoke with today say they have homes to return to. They've been able to verify that by a map put up by Cal Fire. Meanwhile, many of their neighbors have lost homes. They're sending their thoughts and prayers their way.